See, one, one of the things like, you know, I was introduced to shit at, you know, like, uh, uh, mother gave me a gun at nine, so I was introduced to shit at an extremely early age, and I gave me my first so-called territory at nine, you know, which was a, a Marston Avenue, 16th Avenue North, which was a, a dope land, and here you, here you are now you're telling <laughs> addicts <laughs> they got to pay you a dollar to, to be where they be, <laughs> and they were actually paying, and then it was like... Do you see that there's a general commonality between all women, like, from me reading the book and reading about Pam and Lily and these people, like, do you see a common thread in the like, psychological makeup of women? Well, women like men, I mean, you can flip in any kind of way. I don't, it doesn't matter what they come from or who raised them, you know, you can twist a bitch in any kind of way you want to twist them, you know. Mm. It's like clay. It's left to your imagination how you sculpt it. Mm. Mm. <laughs> Damn, that's it. Cut. <laughs> going to cut to the next part. Let's <laughs> <laughs> right off the bar, Mary Sub stop, Philadelphia PA. Shot so loud, you would think it was a club spot. African Americans, although we all over the web, we the hood librarians. We ship the prisons too. We reach out and deliver to those that's bitten too, but it's more than a bookstore. You wonder we got it, mixed taste, DVDs and culture products. Black and Nobel got our hands in a lot of projects. We welcome all to come build, the energy is positive. Every member of the team is awake and conscious. Come through and experience this place of knowledge. They say they'll put it in a book if they want to hide it from us. But we got them books so you can buy it from us. Something to read while you on a train or riding the bus. Get your read on, food for thought, get your eat on. Black and Nobel, I buy my books at Black and Nobel. Black and no bell. I bought my books in black and no bell.